Good morning. Happy New Year. Today is December 31st. I hope you had a beautiful year this past year and that next year is going to only bring blessings and love, peace, joy, and happiness to you. And I am, as you see, I'm in a hotel room and the reason why is because I surprised my mom for her birthday. Her birthday was yesterday and we had a beautiful time and there is pictures on Facebook if you'd like to see. So I made them public so people could see and it was really, really nice to surprise her. I haven't seen her in quite a while so it was good to be around family. Um, I couldn't make it down for Christmas because I was with my other family. <laughs> okay, so today is December 31st. This is a good one. And it says, as you come to the end of the year, take some time to, to look back and also look ahead. Ask me to help you review the highlights of this year. Hard times as well as good times. Try to see me in these memories as for I have been close beside you every step of the way. When you are, when you were, when you were clinging, <laughs> when you were clinging to me for help in the midst of tough times, I comforted you with my loving presence. He's looking for this. I also richly pre presented new circumstances that filled you with great joy. I was with you on the mountain peaks, in the valleys, and everywhere in between. Your future stretches out before me. Well, your future stretches out before you all the way into eternity. I am the companion. Are you okay? Are you okay? He didn't make the jump. I am the companion who will never leave you. The guide who, will, who knows you every step of the way ahead. The joy that awaits you in paradise is inex inexplainable and full of glory. As you prepare into as you prepare to step into the new year, let heaven's light shine upon you, brighten the path just before you. That's Isaiah. Come on. That's Isaiah 43:13, Psalms 16:11, Psalms 48:14, and 1 Peter 1, 8, 9. Are you okay? You didn't make that jump. Yeah, you didn't make it. You're right. You got the spring, though. You got the spring, so you must be okay. Right? You okay? He's so adorable, isn't he? Just so adorable. He's got the spring. He loves springs. Yep. Well, let me get it. But anyways, okay. So, God is with us. Like, <laughs> it's so crazy. I got to talk about this moment. Because uh, it was so funny, um, last week, God said, you know, you can go visit your mom, right? And I'm like, okay, that's, you know, like, I didn't come up for Christmas. And so it was like on my heart to come up here, right? And uh, my brother decided to surprise her too. So she had both children for her birthday with her, which is a blessing, a total blessing. And it was a very, very, very beautiful time. And um, God works in mysterious ways because, you know, um, it just, it, it, it was crazy. It was a God moment, definitely for me a God moment, that he brought family together without us knowing we were all together because I didn't, you know, I didn't know my brother was coming. My brother didn't know I was coming. My mom knew none of us were coming. So it was such a beautiful moment. And it was a great way to end, you know, 2023. It really was. You know, so... 2023 for me has been very, very, um, I learned lots of wisdom, knowledge, understanding. I um, definitely got closer to God in 2023. And, you know, that's the thing we need to do is get closer to God. You know what I mean? It's right here in front of you. Okay. It's right, it's right here. You made that jump. Anyways, yeah. So. We got to get, we do, like, so 2024, next year, you know, um, how are you going to bring in the new year? You know what I mean? Like, I, we, at church, we have a, um, a party, you know, from 8 till midnight tonight at City of Refuge Church. If you want to come, I'll be there. And uh, it's a silver new year. We play board games and everything like that. And so it's, uh, it's very, it's very peaceful because, you know, the thing is, is that, who you surround yourself with and what you do 
is very important. It's so, it's so important. And I just want you to have the best new year, which means 2024. Get closer to God. Talk to God every day, right? Pray, pray. That's one thing God has taught me. Actually, my friend Sarah, you know my friend Sarah. She's posted everywhere with me. Um, so Sarah was like, oh, you know, because I'm feeling some type of way about something. And she's just like, oh, pray. Pray about this. Pray about that. And I'm just like, oh, yeah, duh. Because sometimes we forget that, that we have to pray. So pray. If, you know, if you have a thought or somebody's uh, picture comes across your face, right, or across your mind, pray about that person. Like, really pray. Yes. I love you. And have a beautiful New Year.